Hello everyone, Dr. Zia Tahir here. This video tutorial is solution to problem 1.14 of chapter 1, Fundamentals of Vibration from the book Mechanical Vibration by S.S. Rao, 5th edition. The statement of the problem is, in a centrifugal fan, the air at any point is subjected to an impulse each time a blade passes the point. So the frequency of these impulses is determined by speed of rotation of impeller n and the number of blades in the impeller. So for n is equal to 100 rpm and number of blades as 4 determine first three harmonics. This problem is related to Fourier analysis. So we need to analyze this periodic function. So, this is a discontinuous periodic function between 0 and tau. So, 0 to tau over 4, it is, its value is 100 and then PSI and then tau by 4 to tau, it is 0. So, it is a discontinuous function. So, that is a function, pressure as a function of time is equal to P maximum from 0 to pi by 4 and here A I am uh, writing P maximum as A and it is 0 from tau by 4 to tau. So that is how that periodic function can be written. It says here an impulse subjected to an impulse each time a blade passes the point. So it means that this impulse is linked with one blade. So and then and then number of fluctuations in one minute. So number of revolution of all blades are rotor. It is 100 rpm. So that fluctuation is linked with one blade. So then number of fluctuation in one minute. It is uh, rotational speed of the shaft times by number of blades. So that is 400 revolutions in one minute. So period is time divided by total number of revolutions. So then it comes as 0.15 seconds. So like based on uh, n, lowercase n and uppercase n, the time for one impulse or one fluctuation is 0.15 seconds. So that is the formula for Fourier series. So fx is a0 over 2 plus summation from m equal to 1 to infinity a m cos m x plus b m sin x x and a0. a0 is 1 over pi. So 1, of, 1 over half of the period. So then over the period fx dx and am is 1 over half of the period. So lower limit to upper limit fx cos mx and then dm is fx sin mx. So a0 is 1 over half of the period. So 1 over tau over 2. So it can simplify as 2 over tau. 0 to tau p t d t that is a discontinuous function so it can be integrated from 0 to pi by 4 and then pi by 4 to pi uh, sorry tau over 4 to tau so here it is uh, between that uh, here it is like 0 the function is 0 so this i am going to just discard it and then here pt is a so and then we'll have here a dt so then it will become a t from lower limit 0 to tau by 4 so after substituting the limits so it will be tau by 4 and then tau is going to cancel with tau and you will here a over 2 so that is a 50 psi so a 0 is 50 psi so the next need to find coefficient am so in this formula because the period is 2 pi so it is a shorter version so it can be written as 1 over pi so 
with the limits cos m pi x divided by half of the period. Okay, because for this one in the formula sheet, the period is 2 pi. So then I can write like am is 2 over pi 0 to, to a p t cos m pi t over pi by 2, which is the half of the period dt. And then I have omega is equal to 2 pi over t. So this 2 will go on the top and 2 pi over t is now omega. So that can be written in terms of omega t. And then there are, because the limits are, so when it is 0, so it can be split into two limits. And the, for the second limit, it is 0, we are going to not consider. So only limit from 0 to pi by 4, I am going to consider a cos omega and dt. So then the integration of that a sin omega m sin m omega t over m omega. And then by applying the limits, so sin 0 will be 0. So the lower limit leads to just 0. So we are going to just consider the upper limit, which is 2 over pi a over m sin m omega pi over 4 and then after simplifying it and substituting there omega as 2 pi over tau and here omega as 2 pi over tau so i'll get that am as a over pi m sin m pi over 2. similarly bm it can be written as 2 over pi 0 to pi p t sin m omega t d t and after separating that for the limits, it is 2 over pi 0 to pi by 4 a sin omega t dt and then integration of that is a minus a over m omega cos m omega t and then by applying the limits, so minus 2 over pi into minus a over m omega cos m tau over 4 minus cos 0 and then putting omega as 2 pi over t, so here omega as 2 pi over tau and then here omega as 2 pi over tau and then simplifying bm is minus a over pi m cos m pi over 2 minus 1. So now a0 which is a constant it is 50 psi am and bm expressions are calculated for that. So now <clears throat> once we have values of uh, expression for a0, A, M, and B, M. So then for first three harmonic, so that A0 is a constant, so it will not, it doesn't have any, anything like uh, for the harmonics. So then A, M, so that is A1, A2, and A3, that is B1, B2, and B3, and that is a uh, function now A0 over 2 plus sigma m is equal to 1 to 3 a m cos m omega t plus b m sin m omega t. So omega is equal to 2 pi over tau 2 pi over 0.15. So that is 40 pi over 3. So then p t will become a 0 over 2 which is 25 plus 31.8309 cos here m is equal to 1. So that will become 40 pi over 3 into t plus 31.8309 sin 40 pi over 3 into t. And then the second one here, A1 is 0. So then here it is uh, like 0 plus 31.8309 into sine 2, 2 omega t. So 2 into omega is 80 pi over 3 t. And then the third one is minus 10.613 cos 40 t, 40 pi t. And then so like as 3 times 40 pi over 3, so it is just 40 t plus 10.610 sine 40 pi t. So that is the Fourier series for this problem. So thank you very much for watching.